Hello, this is Andy Ford with Andy Ford Video, and today we're going to look at using the Lumetri Color Panel in Premiere Pro for selective coloring. Here is a clip of two girls eating cotton candy from Envato Elements. Let's say, for example, we want to change the color of this greenish cotton candy to blue. So we'll select the clip, and we'll change into the color mode in Premiere Pro, which will bring up the Lumetri Color Panel. Under the curve section, you see we have an option for hue and saturation curves. We will twirl that down and we will focus on the hue versus hue area. This allows us to make a curve based color adjustment by selecting a hue range and changing it to another hue. So we'll grab the eyedropper and we'll select the greenish cotton candy. Once we make the selection we'll see three control points appear on the graph. This is the range of colors in the area selected. We can take the middle control point, click and hold it, and we can drag up or down to change the hue. In this case, since we want blue, we will bring it down a little bit to the blue section and we see it start to become blue. One of the nice things about this is it is just focusing on the specific hue color. Note that it is not changing the green of the trees or lawn. But as we play the clip, we see there's still a little bit of green at certain times. It's subtle, but it's there. But we can make more control points by directly clicking on the curb. So I'll make one a little left of my center point in the green area and I'll bring that down so we have a wider range of green that we're bringing down to be blue. And now that looks pretty good. As we play the clip, we see that the cotton candy has turned blue. It affects everything of that similar hue, even the piece that the girl is chewing on. And note that it's not affecting similar colors because we have been pretty precise with our controls on the curve. So enjoy using the hue versus hue feature of the Lumetri color panel in Premiere Pro. Thank you.